again. And I'm about to do Vulture's Roost. And I must have done this at some point, but I honestly don't remember. I certainly didn't do it with this character. With Spike, since he's only on NG1. I probably did it with my first character, only Francis Drake. Would explore but this area without a spacesuit. Captain I'm Spike, hello. I am satisfied to see that you survived your most recent sleep cycle. All right. Um, let's change this here. Okay, I have done that. Oh, I have to actually go travel to that. It's there. Oops. My mistake. I actually thought I was here when I last left. So let's pop back into the ship and then head over there. I'm not gonna lift off, but it's easier to be in the ship to hop over there. Because it might get left behind. I think they fixed that glitch. But I've gotten used to popping back into the ship to head over there. That screen there is actually one of my bases. I've added some more to it since then okay let's get out of here and go hit vultures roost as i said Captain spike it is pleasant to see you oh somebody's spaceship is landing This is Vulture's Roost. I don't know why it doesn't want to say that I'm doing the mission here. Oh, because it's still stuck at that. Hmm. Oh, I'm enough of that. We'll head in here because I know this is Vulture's Roost. For some reason, it doesn't want to give me the... Uh, Doesn't want to give me the quest markers yet, but it will eventually. <laughs> Pretty empty. Have I actually stumbled upon a glitch? <laughs> All right, let's go up into the building and see what I can find. Okay, good enough. Should probably use that bleeding and here I was thinking that there wouldn't be anything to do this is one of those weird quest things where it's the quest area but it's not really marked okay definitely don't want to hang in this area too long don't want to waste time picking locks what's that nothing useful always grab the first aid stuff because you can always sell it. It's cheap enough that you can add it in to get the last stuff. Don't want to be hanging out right there either.
Okay, I'm either out of range or there isn't anything worth blowing up there. Okay, lots of people up there. Good shot, whoever did that, me or him. Oh my god, there are still people alive? Yeah, I guess so. at the wrong time. and stuff hanging around here. A lot of places you get yourself blown up pretty quick if you're not careful or hang out too long somewhere. Because these guys have amazingly enough learned how to shoot at fuel tanks now and use the environment. Not nearly as well as you will as a player character, but they've gotten better. Actually, nice view of the ship. Okay, sorry about that. Don't usually stop in the middle and take pictures, but I actually did like that view. Okay, this sounds more like a robot than anything else, but can't really tell. Never mind, I got something for you. Where did he go? Oh, they're up there. Okay. Not bad. I've gotten actually good at that. Okay, don't want that. Make sure there's no... Oh, let's see what the jail computer says. I can unlock all of these. That would be helpful. I still haven't bothered to get the uh, DigiPick mod. I think I'll actually wait until the Creation Club comes out for that. Hmm, that one won't work. At least not in that configuration. Okay, let's see what this one will do.
occasionally look at this stuff because it might lead to somewhere else. And if you're interested, you can actually read the stuff later. Okay, good. All the doors are open, so now I can get in here farther. Okay, I heard this was actually reasonably challenging, and yet I don't see much of it yet. Let's hope it gets better. I think I pointed out I haven't done this. I don't remember what it was like. Okay, what's this thing here? Which should have been a magazine, is not. Okay, don't need any of those. Grab that. Huh, I might see what that looks like. Okay, bunches of cash. Can I sell it? No, that's the messed up thing so far. I can't actually sell stuff like that because nobody has enough credits to buy more than one. Right, don't see anything else extraordinary. Not gonna run through a bunch of lockers. <laughs> Well, I did have that one first big fight where I mowed down a bunch of these guys. Kind of hoping for a bit more. Okay, let's head out here and see if we can find more people to shoot. I don't have great hopes for it, though. But I do have other pirates and things I can go take out, so we'll do that. Okay, locked. Unfortunately, this is a relatively easy one. Oh, well, let me see what happened. Had one of those glitches where it looked like I was kicked offline. I've gotten used to that sort of thing, so I went to check so that I'm not just sitting here talking away. And I'm offline. Alright, Omar. I spelled his name wrong. Anything important in here? No. Don't really feel like being in there. Okay. Board in here. Let's head out and go find. Uh, they only need a decent quality board. All right, action.
Oh, there he is. Uh, get out of the way, Omar. Actually, start aiming. people were recommending coming here. It is pretty interesting, at least for the fighting. <clears throat> okay, somebody is over there. Oh, great. Lots of fuel tanks go like that. Oh, their spaceship is here too. I have to take this guy out quickly and then go run out to the spaceship. Although I'm fairly decent idea of the spaceship is nothing that I want, actually, but it's there. Let's see what it is. Okay, let's see what this one is. Nothing. Hmm. Okay, this wasn't that horrible. I would not have bothered with this, except this guy's in there. The ship probably took off. This is kind of shitty, but oh well. Uh, Synthetic punk music, God help us.
I'm not gonna bother looking for the other ship. I'm sure it's long since gone. I have to go down that way. Because the gravity's too high in here to do it. Oh, there. Hmm. Oh, the jail computer. One could hope. Okay, head down here. See if there's anybody I didn't collect their stuff from. Wonder why they show the dramatic music get past there so that way some fools are rifling them, blowing me off the freaking planet. What? Oh, that's kind of crappy accommodations for these guys. I mean, seriously. And let's go see our friend, the robot. <clears throat> okay, let's see what I actually have here. Not gonna worry about acquiring powers. Let's go kill somebody at a deserted relay station. Captain Spike, greetings. Well, the vulture's rest was kind of interesting but somehow i think the quest has glitched us that it doesn't register once you get there it's like just getting there is the quest and then you can decide whether you want to take these guys out or not well i can see why people come in here and fight these guys off it is pretty challenging although it might be better if the ai didn't like send five of them down a corridor right at you while you're sitting there with a machine gun yeah, right. Could almost hope for bandits to shoot at me, but no. Might do a ship upgrade. I've already got the engine and the grab drive really as high as I can get them in this ship. And since I can get places fairly quickly, and my maximum speed is around 140, I don't see the need to improve those much. Thinking about adding an extra weapon, even though I, I mean, upgrading one of my weapons. But at this point, I obliterate anything that I come across anyway. Okay, to the relay station. Let's scan that. If it's not too much trouble, I almost always. Oh, this is have a trait. Forget it. If I wasn't actually recording. I would probably go ahead and scan the rest of it. Depends. If the anomaly site, or the interest site is right there, I'll go look for it. But if not... No, that's kind of cool. I'm guessing I have to go there. Captain. Okay, that's that. That's not the area. You always scan anyway. Just because, like, that's a site of interest up there. But it's kind of far away. But if you were to see something like a ship landing zone, you might want to go over there because somebody will end up showing up. Here it looks like it's going to be pretty straightforward. They'll run up here and take this guy out. Since it's in the pirate bounty rotation, I'll scan anyway because eventually I'll run into this again and I can finish it off.
I can appreciate the space music, but after a while it's like, it really isn't music in space. What you could do is do something like they did with the uh, Vegas radio station, since they have a bunch of the free archive stuff. Have us listen to that. All right, next time I come back here, it will be worthwhile scanning the weird places. But right now, I'm not gonna bother. Okay, let's go over here. Amazingly, nobody's standing around outside. Okay, that's suspicious. Ah, here he is. Yes. Okay, they're all active now. Just come out, come out. I'm getting tired of this. I'm still surprised more of them have popped out, but okay, I guess. It'd be really inconvenient if someone popped out of here now. eventually will. I guess not. Okay. still outside somewhere, which is fine by me. As long as you're doing something useful. Only a matter of time. Oh, I hope he isn't locked behind this stupid door.
like I can't do it anymore because the Oscars are running in front and it'd be bad for everybody. So, what? Oh. Okay, I took these guys out. Didn't have anything. Again, the problem is they have stuff, but there's no way you can sell any of it, so there's no reason to carry it. Either let us break the stuff down or give the vendors more money. No, admittedly, after a while, you don't really need to worry about money for most things. But when you're selling half billion dollar spaceships or half million dollar spaceships, kind of need money. Okay, go downstairs because they do have something that is probably useless that I don't want but the cart is there what's this in here credits those are always good mines I can sell I'll make the quick check in here because sometimes they have a book you can also find credits in here but I'm mainly interested in occasionally they have the magazines that boost your stats that's locked Anything in there that I want? Nope. They have to make lock picking better. Different something. I don't mind the, it, the uh, playing around the skills that much, but it gets real boring real fast, and you die. Just don't bother going picking through locks or going through doors because it's not worth it. <laughs> All right, out of the airlock. to this ship. I don't actually mind doing that. <clears throat> After a while, it does get boring walking everywhere. <clears throat> and even when we do get vehicles, I will probably hop over to this ship. <clears throat> okay, let's take care of some do ship to ship combat since so those are fairly fast. And with that, next adventure is done. The bounty quest is one of the main reasons why I jump straight over to the Free Star Rangers over there and start doing their quests. And even doing the first one getting you into the Rangers gives you access to their bounty board which is well worth the time and effort. Hello, Could Diego. Use your help? We're dead in the water here. Oh, guys, sorry. I actually do help them. Now, oh, here we go. Credits, yeah. <clears throat> the best part of doing the pirate bounty hunts is that if you need the ship kills for various achievements, you can get those fairly easy here. You get a bunch of ship kills.
and you get to see some really cool looking planets too. A bank, a bank ship, oh god, there are days when I wish I was a pirate. Those bank ships are really easy to take over. Better be a... at least one of these. They usually have a decent amount of money on somebody's. And since this looks to be the lead ship, oh well. Don't want to find the power from beyond. We'll take care of these guys and then finish up taking care of this guy on my home planet or the one with my base on it it would be nice if there's a button where you can go from this screen to the screen you need whatever info screen it might be and then back to this screen without going through an extra screen or two first now I'm actually getting to nitpicking quality of life stuff other people say, oh god, the game's unplayable. She has to go through the two extremes. I've been playing Bethesda games for our next jump soon. I'm making another run out of New Atlantis, taking Universal to get closer to God and to a Space travel is dangerous. Whether it's respect for our... Have you ever felt something? I've jumped dozens of times, but I'll keep jumping. I'm giving me star. You sound so... Sh it was a pleasure <coughs> talking with you, but I hope God watch... You're always nice to those people, even though it's sort of repetitious dialogue. Same way you're always nice to Grandma. I mean, like some sort of monster if you actually take these people out. <coughs> Even the spacers in that ignore them. No oh, good, my automated weapons are causing serious amounts of damage. Okay, let's head to here. And then after that, I'll give it a break. Doing these are okay, but they're kind of boring doing the power from beyond ones. They're kind of necessary, but nevertheless boring. That might be actually worth scanning all of it, depending on how those always look weird and freaky. Even more so the creatures on the screen here, even more so when you're actually playing the game. That's probably what I'm attacking right there. Like you must feel right at home here, huh? Okay. 
Okay, since I'm scanning three things here only. Okay, that did that. Here's an opportunity to grab this real quick. I don't even bother. And with any luck, I'll find the other one very, very quickly, my third resource. The reason why you do this is because it adds out another thousand that you can pick up from any, pretty much anybody. I know Victor supposedly gives you more money. It's honestly not worth running over there though. Again, you can, they can only take so much money. Alright, in here... any luck he didn't notice me. That guy, whoever he is though, did. Oh, there he is. That alerted more people over here. Wait just a minute or two to see if they come on over and investigate. No, at least not for the moment. See if I can see anybody up there. There's one. Oh, you really don't want me to do that, do you? Yeah. Still not in range. Or in range. Okay, there's a bunch of these guys in the complex itself. confidence. Oh, 
here he is. Hiding. Come on, you. Nep combat is still glitchy at times, but I've seen worse. Since I'm here, might as well see what else they have. Okay, let's see if these guys have anything useful in here. I don't even bother with the weapon crates, just grab more mats. <clears throat> Alright, not quite done exploring in here. Oh, there it is. 
ammo crate, forget that. That's not, not worthwhile. That space is never worthwhile. All right, let's go back and clear out a few more pirates on the way out. Or maybe not. Okay, let's see if there's anything worth here. I'll take that. Hmm, might actually be worth upgrading that. I'll see how it compares to my stuff. Okay, what's this? That too could be really good to solve. In fact, that is really, really good. So that would look really good upgraded compared to what I have. All right. Actually, stuff worth taking, I'm amazed. Okay, let's get the hell out of here and head back to Delgado. Uh, yeah, Delgado and collect the rewards and stuff. That was pretty profitable, actually. You see a bunch of crap don't even bother taking to sell. Okay, there are most likely people in here. They most likely... Oh, Omar probably kills everybody in here because that's just what happens when there are two buildings. The companion pops in and wakes everybody in the other building while these guys here are trying to kill you best they can. <sighs> Solvent is good for when you're making... Uh, Weapon mods, I always pick it up even when I don't have it tagged. A few things like adhesives are good for that too. Okay, this is going all the way back to the other place with the stuff we didn't want. Alright. there and taking the chance that somebody shows up and it ends up forcing me to walk over there. I'm gonna just pop on over and be done with it. Okay, let's see. That's going to want me to go find, uh... Want me to go find the secret power. Okay, I have three bases, really. This is my helium plant. There's just nothing going on there. Actually, I might as well go over there, though, just to see if... a oh, crash site. Head home there just to see if anything needs to be done. As far as adding more furniture and that, I actually have some extra crew people sitting over here. As you can see, for some reason on this outpost, the ship doesn't land there. I don't know why. I have to teleport over to it. Oh, there's my team. Couple of lifters, the home. 
pumping out O3, I mean HE3. And let's go see the ship. This is not the most exciting of my outposts, but considering that it manufactures all of my H3 for fuel, and it actually, I somehow, by some miracle, got it set up to transfer it, it works out well. As you can see, the ship, for whatever reason, does not like landing on this. All my other ships do. Okay, let's look at the ship builder console, view and modify, not buying anything. This is the Bebop, and it's what I'm running around in right now. <coughs> look at the ship builder. And I am currently have two of these going, the auto turrets, two of those going, the obliterator auto turrets, and then regular laser so I actually have something to do when I shoot at things rather than letting the auto turrets take care of it. Most things do not survive this. And I could actually add probably one of those in but no real reason to do so. They just cut down on my mobility. I have the largest engines and the larger grab drive. So, that's that. Oh, and here it is, finally. I don't know why it ends up landing over there. Anyway, that's it for today. I will see you later. And like, comment, share, all things like that. If you comment, I actually do at answer them. Uh, sometimes not the same day. It kind of depends. But I do actually answer stuff. So I will see you later.